new documentary, Lady Wrestler, the amazing untold story of African-American women in the ring, chronicles trailblazing women who broke racial and gender boundaries in the historically male-dominated sport back in the 1950s, 60s, and 70s. While I was making the documentary, I had the honor of interviewing three of these legends, Ethel Johnson, Ramona Isbell, and Ethel Brown. Ethel Brown, by the way, happens to be Caucasian, but she befriended several of the African-American women and offers invaluable insight and commentary. Now, when you're making a documentary, you have to choose a framework to tell the story. So I chose to focus on the women whom I had immediate access to, as well as the relationship between Ethel Johnson and her sisters, Babs Wingo and Marva Scott, who also were trailblazing wrestlers and both of whom passed away in 2003. There are many women of all different races who courageously broke barriers as professional wrestlers back in the day. And while I didn't have the opportunity to interview or spotlight all of them in the documentary, they certainly deserve recognition. So for the remainder of this video, I'm going to display photos of women wrestlers that I uncovered in my research, but whom I did not get to interview or feature in an in-depth way. Many of the photos are from the huge wrestling archive at the University of Notre Dame in South Bend, Indiana. This photo montage is in no way a complete or comprehensive list of all the women who wrestled in the 20th century. And in fact, the, the montage spotlights black women since that's the focus of the documentary. I've done my best to include names with the photos wherever possible. I'm sure diehard wrestling fans will notice omissions of women wrestlers who are not featured in this montage, but I assure you, any omission is not intentional. And if you notice a wrestler whose name I misidentified, please bring it to my attention and I'll do my best to correct the error and repost this video in a timely fashion. I hope you enjoy this photo montage, which is meant to be a tribute to these incredible women, recognizing the sacrifices they made and acknowledging their courage, strength, and true grit. 